as you may have heard, boxer Ryan Garcia is to fight Devin Haney this time in April. And over the past week, he's been posting a bunch of random things that um, have his followers pretty concerned. And they're asking him if he's okay, if he's going crazy, or if he's on drugs in the comment section. And then after a little while, he made this last post. So yeah, pretty cryptic, I'll say, um, to say the least. But Ryan popped back up after uh, on a Twitter call with Andrew Tate where he said this. All right, talk to us. Bro, I don't give a f They held me down and they made me watch little kids get raped. I don't give a f anymore. Where? Bro, they f took me to the fucking woods, bro, and they f I I'm not fucking joking, bro. I have fucking proof, bro. I don't give a f Bro, I'll fucking show you every fucking video you could ever fucking leave. Bohemian Grove is real. They fucking tied me down and they made me fucking watch, dog. I absolutely don't give a f anymore. Yes, I fucking lost it. They're raping little kids. And, um, yeah, I, I, that's a lot. And those are, like, some serious accusations. Um, and I have, like, you know, one of, th like, three possible explanations for what's going on. So, yeah, uh, the first possible explanation is that this is all drug-induced. And if so, I hope that he gets help. The second one is that this is all real. And I don't really doubt that the things that he's accused, you know, the elites exist in. is like, uh, I don't doubt that that is real. But... Um, yeah, the second one is that it's real, but if so, there are a lot of holes in the story, like why he said he was tied up, and then in another video before that, he said that he had his phone taken, and his account hacked or something, and then he got it back, but like, um, so yeah, if you were tied up, why would they, number one, why would they select you, of all people, to take to that area, tie you up, and then how did you escape, and then he also said he had proof, but then he's not showing any, and then he's also saying, I don't care, I don't do an F. So there are a lot of holes in your story. How did you get tied up? How are you still alive to talk about the things that you saw? Uh, um, so yeah, it's a little, it's very shaky. Or, you know, another part of the second explanation is that he's a puppet for they, or whatever you want to call them, he's a puppet outright, and he's just faking it or playing to some sort of agenda. And then the third and final one is that this is all a marketing scheme and uh, it's all fake to generate hype for the fight, I think. I'm not, I don't watch boxing like that and I don't, I don't know how the boxing business works, but I'm going to assume that Ryan Garcia, like the fight would not have pulled that many people or so he's trying to do some promo for it, I don't know. And he's trying to get a lot of eyes and attention on him generally. And, you know, to the, to the, to people saying, why would he do that? He already has money, he already has fame. To that, I'll say, why do a lot of greedy people in the industry do what they do? There are a lot of stuff that are fake, publicity, publicity stunts, etc. So this is not, to me, it's not above anyone. Um, I'm not saying he's doing it, but I wouldn't be surprised if he is, because it's a very corruptible industry. So anything could happen, anyone could be doing anything for any reason. And I feel like it's always more money to be made, or at least that's the perspective that a lot, of the, a lot of these people might have also so yeah um, yeah that's about it um i'm leaning more towards either fake on marketing or it's real but there are a lot of holes in his story so yeah leave a comment down below uh what you think peace